Welcome back, everybody, back to some more Star Wars 2. And I have decided I am going to upgrade all the ships. Size 1 gunships don't make any sense to me. So we're going to make them size, I don't know, 10. We're going to 10x everybody. And then, um... It's a gunship, it's a support ship, it's combat. It needs, it needs better. What is this? Reduces labor cost of the support ship. Increases build cost of the support ship. So build faster. Then there's crew deck. Provides control. Okay. There's ammo stores. I mean... That means you can send them on sorties. Sort of. We got Muon cannons. Which are better. Than rail guns. Limited fire arc. This is... Fires batches newly created Muons. Rapid fire rate. Lower damage and accurate. Fire pierces through armor, ignores damage resistance. Yeah, I mean, let's. Let's, uh, here, I'll do this. Whoa. It made the gunship very, um, tanky. <laughs> it's just, got, it's got a lot of health. One gun now. I'm for it. I'm for it. It, um, its damage is 10. So I'm gonna save it. Congratulations, upgraded, upgraded gunship. You are now upgraded. Size 10. Alright, so missile boat. It's gonna upgrade you to size 20. And you're going to be artillery. Because you're a missile boat, and then we'll see what um, what auto build does for us here. Please note the missile is 203 damage at four seconds. Auto build. Whoa. You went with some AI core action and lasers. Hate it. Next. Torpedo. Holy Toledo. 50 damage torpedo and an unheard of amount of armor. Let's uh, let's fix this problem. Missile launcher. What's with all the AI core? Is there like a stat? Dump all this inner armor. It's an AI missile ship. It's not even close to the damage. Wow, this is... This is, uh... It's really slow, too. I'm gonna have to speed this thing up. You gotta be six speed, I think. Back to defense. Ablative is... Stiff absorb damage from blading it away. And this is just heavy. High damage resistance. High health. What's the difference? Your health is 30. Health is 45. Damage resistance almost 3. Damage resistance 1. Okay, we'll just throw some ablative armor out there. So then, as far as control is concerned... Provides control to operate other subsystems. I don't believe... I need... These. Yeah, the control, it's, this is the control. I don't have other subsystems. Um, what do I have here? Reload speed. Only one per missile launcher, okay. Support crates, defense, propulsion, you got the rocket engine. I don't have shields yet. More missile, please. Okay, that's a pretty good amount of missile. Still going six speed. Uh, the missile is 
181 damage. It's not enough yet. Let's give it more missile. Oop, 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 we'll put that defense back. Here, I'll just throw this one here. This one here. Um, you're still good speed. Missile flies out of the back. This thing's like defensive, man. You're still good speed. There you go. Have some more health. Live longer. Choose life. Alright, that's going to be the missile boat. So you're six speed. I got to check to make sure this gunship is six speed. You are. You are. Your gun is 16 damage. Can I give it a modifier? They'll shoot faster. Take it out. What does it do? It lowers the amount. What does it actually do? Decreases health by 50%. Increases reload speed by 20%. DPS goes up quite a lot. But the health goes down a little. It's fine. It's fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. You are... You are fine. I'll save you. Okay, gunship's going to be 80 size. That's, uh, that's going to be big. And you are, in fact, a cannon. And we are going to generate new. Let's see what happens. Too many missiles. You now have this big gun. You don't need any of this stuff. Uh, you'll need one of these, though. Okay, I think you're too slow. Probably. So let's grab you. And... Control. I mean, if you're going to use AI core and one gun, you really should just make your gun a muon cannon, right? No, you can be a real gun. You are, you are supposed to be a heavy gunship. And what I'll do is I'll just do that. Your speed is 7. And your real gun does 238 damage. Damage for seconds 170. You got 6,000 health. You got a bunch of space left. So why don't I just increase even more the size of the gun to be even more of the ship. And then the defense will be more armor. Like this. This will slow it down a little. But I think we'll be okay. Yeah, you're six speed. You got a giant gun. Okay, that's what we're going to do. Hopefully this doesn't, like, screw it up. Alright, the beam ship's going to be 40 size. Just put you to 40 size here. I'm going to make you... We'll raid enemy fleets. We'll equip the animal source. No. I find openings to raid vulnerable enemy supports. Um, could make these just not nah, cannons, cannons, just whatever. You're going to um, we're going to do this. We're going to do this. There you go. AI beam ship. Look at that. Uh, must be faster. More engine. Required. Okay, that's more engine required. And I don't need this. So we can increase laser power. I can increase laser power more by two points. So there you go. Two points extra laser. And then the modifiers will be ram, bam, thank you, ma'am. Um, some defense. We'll throw in some regular armor, you know, here and there, just to help out. 
And I will move the control, the anchor, from here to... Do I want my anchor on this one? Slowly repairs. This increases the build cost, the dollars. So if I put a defense right here, there's still seven speed. I can add one piece of rocket engine somewhere there. Never mind. I messed that up. Go back to the blade of armor. Seven speed. It's beautiful. Yeah, I should I should use regular core, not AI core. Cause it's not Is it labor outside problem? I don't think so much. I think it's the money's the problem. So the gunships are size ten. Regular core. So that means you gotta update two. You have reactive armor. Destroyer hull. Hull optimized to fit many different weapon turrets at the cost of being unable to field support fleet. Can I have any support command on the flagship? Weapon range reduced. So you can just make really big. Increase health by 500%, increase armor resistance, decreases mass, more internal space. Oh my. Yeah, you need you need some stuff. You need some stuff. And we got um, shield generators and stuff. I'm just going to build a whole new ship. Create a design. It's going to be 1,000 size. It's going to be a flagship. This is going to be, um, this is going to be our, oh, what's it going to be? I have no idea. Uh, Leviathan. Sure, it's a Leviathan. It's going to be controlled by bridge and crew. So there's that. It's going to have a fleet computer. Is it? Increases flagship repair rate. Yes. An AI control computer as well? For the first 30 seconds of combat, the strength of the entire is boosted by percentage dependent on the size of the controlled computer. Oh my, that's amazing. It'll be just boosted a little bit, that's fine. Uh, you might need... Requires a lot of space to provide significant power. I don't think we need a lot of power. Let's provide support command. We will need these, like crazy, because you need a giant fleet with you. Um, probably that much. Supply, storage, definitely need a lot of that. Five hundred thousand supply storage is pretty good. Power, we're already using too much power. There we go. Weapons. You have a carpet bomb, you have lasers, missiles, torpedoes you need. Torpedo. Okay, big fatty torpedo. That's a pretty good weapon. To give you, do you got Muon? Yeah, you got Muon, so we can give you a Muon. Uh, maybe we have a regular missile. Uh, I might put rocket pods. Rocket pods. There's the rocket one. And this thing's gonna look weird, man. Oops. There's a rocket two. Is that the same strength? 35. Yeah, these are the same size now. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, six. Perfect. We want cannons, please. I need to put some armor in here, too. So it's going to be a hyperdrive. I need you to go pretty fast in hyperdrive land. That's a thousand speed. My laser simulator. Realistic combat simulator that the crew can train, but not 
Upon orders, the ship slowly gains veterancy levels while stationed in a friendly system. The larger the simulator, the faster it gains experience. Oh my. Simulator. Uh, tractor beam, no. Modifier. Oh, it's got bulkhead. Increases the health of the... S Ooh, wow, okay. Um, cannot be placed on bridges or coalesced subsystems. Increases the build cost. Targeting sensor. Increases the range of the weapon. Ooh. Putting range onto the torpedo launcher would be pretty good. Yeah. Can I put a bulkhead on it, too? I think is it more health? Gives me 4,000 health. That decreases the health, and this increases the health. So this increases the health by how much? No idea. No idea. So I can throw some lasers on it too. And then some missiles at the back, probably. Like, how about I put a laser... Hmm... Is that equal? Uh, yeah, we're gonna do this. It's gonna be a big laser. Big laser. Way too much power required. This is a 1,000 damage laser. Crazy. We'll need more power for that. And then I can throw some engines on it too. Can be placed internally. Hello. Artificial gravity allows seemingly reactionless engines to propel spacecraft. Provides slower with less expensive build. High power needs. High turn rate. So rocket engines. Put a rocket engine. Last rocket engine. You're going to have to be at least 6 speed. Um, nope, 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 nope. And I need more power too. Power, 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 power. Here. Gonna have to be fusion generator. Fusion generator. We're too big. We are too slow. Oh, we're not too slow. I haven't even armored this thing up yet. Okay, I need to take out some stuff. Um, so, first things off, I need the extra rocket pod bits. I can shave off a little bit of laser, which will let me shave off some power. Mm hmm. I'll have to shave off some engine. There we go. And now defense. Uh, damage hits exceeding the threshold reduce significantly. Effective against... Oh, shields. Hmm. Interesting. Putting a shield on the ship would be pretty good. How about... How about I remove some of the laser, replace it with shields, throw in one more AI controller. Hmm. Low power too. I need way more shield than that. Way more shield than that. <sighs> what do I do? What do I do? What do I do? This laser's gonna be little. And I'm gonna have to do more... 
fusion power. To get one of that. Put in one more fusion. There we go. So that's 2,500 shield. It's not much. Regen's 125 per second. That's not bad. Um, 32,000 health. That's going to go up in a second. Okay, so we're going to do... Some reactive armor here. In case we take big front hits. Like this. Big front hits will be stopped by reactive plating. It's going to slow us down really fast. Boom, 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 boom. Yes, it's going to slow us down. Not great. Okay. So that's when we put in the resistance armor. And we're going to get slowed down even more. So this will take shots to our front and sides. Um, put these back here. Defend the systems. I think I'm going to have to shrink the uh, size of the torpedo. Or support, perhaps. Because we're going to need more engine. Rocket engine. Reduce supports. We need even more speed. We're super slow. Huh. Over this, more engine. Still super slow. Or five speed. It's gonna have to do. Eighty thousand health. Got some pretty gnarly weapons. Yeah, I think we'll be okay. It was pretty fast in FTL. Okay, let's save it and compare it against the needle. Needle's 53,000 health. And it's guns. It's got these Muon cannons that hit like a truck. Torpedo and a missile. Torpedo doesn't hit very hard. Maybe you should have just a ton of torpedoes. This thing can have support command 3,700. Um... You have all this armor, supply storage, and there's another support command out there. Very strange ship. Okay, let's go back and check out the Leviathan here. So your support command's higher. Your speed's 5. What about your speed? 5.8. You got power, your hyperspeed is 716, or 796, we got a shield on this one. Um, obviously the weapons don't match up very well. 421, 721, 5388. Well, your total DPS is 1500, your total DPS is 1000, so you get less damage. But then again, you got this massive, massive thing here. Giant 81 radius, like your super torpedo. I should get rid of some torpedo. Had some propulsion. That is what I decided. So, bye bye. Extra torpedo. Uh, throw that away. There we go. Uh, still 74 range but now we're a lot faster and I think with our bigger ships supporting us we're going to be okay I could
could get rid of this laser. I think I might. Maybe I just do more torpedoes on the big ship. Just because of the torpedo brawler. What's your reload? 19 seconds? That's a lot. 6 seconds. No move on cannons. I don't like his note. You know what? Let's save it like this. So you got the speed. Um, can I... I'm going to take this battleship. It's also 5 million bucks and 500 labor. It's kind of nuts. I'm going to take this battleship at 200 size. I'm going to apply destroyer hull to it. Make it 300 size. It's going to be called the battleship. It's going to be called the battle destroyer. Okay. we got to get rid of all the support command. Let's just do this. Uh, nope, don't like it. I like this better without the missile launchers. Graviton engines are a little weird. Okay, I can make some changes on this. You got a shield? You got some support command? You probably need some supply, but we can remove all of this. Um, you have some serious fusion generators. It's a bridging crew. Cannot have support command. You do not have support command anymore. You have 83 support command. Right there. Okay, so we're going to change the engines to rocket engines. Um, yeah. Graviton engines are good. But uh, rocket engines are better. There we go. So you got some you got decent supply. I want to change these to torpedoes, not missiles. Because missiles, they don't have an AOE factor to them. Whereas torps do. There we go. Big old 300 damage torpedo. And we'll just slot in another one. Not big enough. 316. Perfect. So two of those. Um, we have a ton of extra space. Probably... We're well, not going to have fleet. Probably supply storage. You can just make it so you have tons of bullets. Your million dollar ship. You need more armor. You need a better shield. Yeah, a better shield is better. I need it to be stronger than this. Way stronger than this. Oops. Way stronger than this. Hmm. I still have way more parts. So we can do... What can I do? Blade of Armor would be helpful. Simulator. Insufficient control. It takes two control, really. Three control. So I can even put one simulator on it. Yeah, it takes three control. Interesting. Uh, what's your supply cost to shoot? 2,000? 21 seconds? Well, now you get the range. Same with you. Same with you. Uh, coolant system makes you shoot faster. 17 seconds. You're shooting at 0.17. Can do that. Put in the bulkhead. 
put in the bulkhead, please. Uh, this is exterior power. Hmm. Timer. Okay, so I think more engine is required. Um. That's turn rate. Requires power to turn. Expensive build has high power needs. Can be placed internally. If only graviton engines are present on the ship. The ship will not need to rotate at all to move. Low turn rate. High turn rate. Can put like a thruster on here. Can do something like that. A little bit extra turny oomph. High turn right. Uh, I guess more shield. Just more shield for days. Defense. The whole back of the ship is the shield generator. Don't blow it up. Um, power. We got lots of power still. I have one more point. And you go pretty quick, but you don't have enough armor. Um, there's. High damage resistance. This is heavy. So it's gonna slow us down. Okay, I'll take damage resistance on the shield. I'll slow us down a little. The ship is now cooler. Like that. Like that. Like that. Like that. Just some extra armor here and there. Okay, this could be a, a battle destroyer that's two million dollars, but it's got a massive shield. It's got 149 thousand health, and then you know damage per second is only 409. It's not great, but I think as a torpedo launcher with 1700 range on it. That's not bad. So we can jump into a place and just fire these torpedoes. Oh, should I change these to torpedo launchers too? These are basically the defense guns. It's a range. Yeah, if something gets close. I think you just need to be ranged. Super ranged. Huh. Could I just make a destroyer that's a full torpedo bay, essentially. Because these shoot 3,000, so I'll do 6,000 supply every 17 seconds. So 60,000 supply is 170 seconds. Okay. You don't use supply, right? These will be burning some supply as well if they fight. So I'll have like 340 seconds. That's... 120,000 supply, so I'll have another, well, 17 times 3, so about 500 seconds of fighting, which is, uh, how many minutes? <laughs> like, 9 minutes, maybe, if it can even survive that long. Alright, let's save it and try it out. Let's save it and try it out, okay. Well, that's gonna do it for this episode, folks. I'll see you in the next one.